Here's how to import videos in CapCut Mobile. Now, if you're on an iPhone or an Android and you wanted to bring some videos into CapCut to edit them, and then you can export them and share them on social media, I'll show you how to do it. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, let's open up the CapCut app here. And there are a couple different ways to add videos. The first one is if you're just setting up a new video to edit, you can tap on New Project. And now from here, all you need to do is find a specific video. So let's say I'm going to choose this one and I can hit add. So now I've added this video on here from this screen. If I decide after the fact I wanted to add another one, I can also tap on that little plus at the very bottom right. So tap on it and it'll pop up with the ability to add a different photo or video. So tap on it and hit add. And just like that, you'll be able to see both of the videos right there. You can always tap on the video and you can drag it back and forth if you wanted to reorder those specific videos. Now, keep in mind, the videos that you can add from here are only from the gallery on the Photos app. So let's say you have a photo in the Files app. So let's open up the Files app here. Say you downloaded this online. Let me go all the way back here, tap on my iPhone and downloads. Now let's say I have this downloaded video from the web, Google, whatever. Maybe it's a stock video. I can tap and hold on it. And what I'm gonna do on here is I'm gonna hit share. And then if I scroll down a little bit, you can see save video. So this isn't entirely clear, but this will save it to the photos app. So hit save video. And just like that, you can hop back into CapCut, tap the little plus there, and now you'll be able to see that video you just added. You can tap on add to add that as well to your CapCut if it's in the files app. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.